We're moving, you guys. So I finished editing the apartment tour video that you guys are about to see and I realized that I didn't film a introduction so if you are new here hi if you are a returning subscriber hi as well we are moving from Boston Massachusetts to Tampa Florida we went to Tampa last week to tour apartments and really figure out if we wanted to commit to that huge of a move and we decided to yes a let's pack everything up and move to Tampa to start a brand new chapter in our lives. I'm super excited. Let's just go see some apartments now. What do I have to say to keep you by, by my side? The first apartment we saw was a beautiful two bedroom and two bath. This apartment was 1196 square feet for about 2279 a month. It featured a courtyard view with dark gray quartz counters, a washer and dryer, hardwood style flooring throughout the apartment except for the bedrooms, which was a little bit of a downfall, but I've noticed that a lot of apartments in Tampa actually have carpets in the bedrooms and hardwood flooring throughout the rest of the apartments. It also had a small patio space where you could put out two chairs, have your morning cup of coffee, and I thought it was really cute. The second apartment was located in the same complex, but it was actually a one bedroom and one bath. It was 783 square feet and $17.95 a month. It featured the same exact amenities and the same style as the first apartment. It was just smaller because it was only a one bedroom. In October, it feels like summertime. I keep falling for you like every night. The great thing about these apartments is that they're only seven minutes away from downtown by car so you're close to the city but you don't have to deal with all of that city noise so I really like that. Like day by day. I'm all up in the clouds when it's pouring rain. Ain't never coming down unless you call my name. Yeah we should take it slow just like day by day. Like day by day.
The third apartment was located right on the river walk in downtown and it was a one bedroom and one bath with 801 square footage and between $2,117 to $2,797. You're definitely compromising size for the luxury of living in downtown. The square footage for this apartment was a lot smaller than the first two apartments I saw but the price was more expensive. Despite the price, I thought it was a beautiful apartment for maybe one person or a couple just starting out because it was on the smaller side. The fourth apartment was in the same complex as the third, but it was a bit smaller. It was still a one bedroom and one bath with a small patio area. The patio area was actually facing the street, so you would see cars passing by every single day at all times of the day so i don't know if you would really want to sit out there and have a cup of coffee or have a drink it honestly would depend on the type of person that you are but i really didn't like that the patio faced the street that's just my personal preference Both apartments had hardwood flooring throughout except for the bedroom. I think that is just a Tampa thing. So those are the apartments that we toured. We actually toured a fifth apartment, but the experience was so horrible, if I'm honest, that I just did not film it. Like the leasing agent was rude and it was just not the vibe. So I didn't film it and I obviously am not going for that apartment. I will be sharing the name of one of the apartment buildings. I can't share the name of the first apartment just because we actually just signed a lease for that apartment and I don't want my address on the internet for safety reasons. I will be sharing my reasons or our reasons for moving in my next vlog which will be the Tampa Florida vlog and you guys will understand why we decided to make the big move and we definitely learned a lot apartment hunting in Tampa if you guys want like a separate video with the things that we learn any tips that I would give if someone is planning to make a move to Tampa definitely let me know in the comments below and I can make a separate video on all of that because there was a lot that we learned and I'm just so excited for this new chapter and if you want to follow along our journey make sure that you hit that subscribe button i would love to have you a part of my little community here on youtube make sure that you give this video a big thumbs up and i'll see you guys in the next one bye guys